Hello everyone, RiceTime911 here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to enable the development console for Farming Simulator 2017. It's very useful for finding errors in your mods or others' mods and fixing them because it helps you find out what those errors are for one. So anyways, how to enable it is you go to My Games in my documents, that's where you'll find it, my documents, my games, Farming Simulator 2017, then you'll see game XML document. You'll want to open that with notepad, and then what you're going to want to do is you're going to look for a line in the code that says development, like right here, and under controls where it says, well usually it would say false like that. So where it says false, you're going to want to change that to true, and that will enable it. Then you'll save and close, and then you'll want to run your game. So right here, Farming Simulator 2017. Okay, so now that you're in Farming Simulator 2017, how you can enable the development console is you press the little wavy line to the left of the one key at the top of your keyboard. I'll open it. And to go up and down in the list here, you just press page up. And to go down, you press page down. I'll show you any errors or any problems with your mods. Like here it says warning, script, entity, backlights, and so on and so forth. It'll tell you any problems with your mods or anything. And also you can go to another place which I'll show you at the end of this. And it'll also show you these errors. So how to use this development console is you can press the little wavy line again. And you'll see a little hashtag come up. A little blinking line. And you can press tab to put in a command such as, let's say, set daytime. So you can set daytime to 10. And you can also do other things like all these other commands. I'm not quite sure what they all do, but there's all sorts of different commands you can use. Now, I'm going to show you where the log is, which will also sh show you some of the errors. Another way to see the errors is to go to My Documents, then My Games, then Farming Simulator 2017, then Log. You'll open that, and I'll show you the errors as well. Pretty much the same as the development console, only difference is in game, you can see it with the development console, whereas here it's not in game. And also the development console can make commands and stuff, whereas you can't really hear. So yeah, this is another place you'll find errors and stuff, so you can know what to fix. So yeah, that's pretty much the gist of it. The log and development console, and how to use them, and how to enable the development console. So yeah, this is RiceTime911, thanks for watching, I'll see you in the next video, maybe.